<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Rob Carpenter here for Real News Talk today. And I'm coming with our first podcast actually uh, this week. The George Floyd, Derek Chauvin trial is going on. And so we have someone, one of our good friends and mentors on the ground there in Minneapolis, Mr. Thomas A. Masters. We're having some technical difficulty, but I have him here on the iPad. Uh, Bishop, if you just kind of give us a little bit of uh, kind of what's going on, what's going on on the ground there in Minneapolis. Well, uh, Brother Tommy, I can just tell you that the community is united. one uh, is praying for design one verdict, and that verdict is guilty. Uh, um, there's been, there are any if and buts about that. Uh, the protest administration on night uh, down by the courthouse and uh, tomorrow uh, there where uh, the 20 year old kid was uh, killed about 10 miles from here will be there tomorrow people are uh, very engaged very much engaged uh, in, in this process and they want justice and they want justice now and the cry has been no justice no peace and so i can just tell you that um uh, everything remains to be seen how this is going to turn out. I just don't see how a jury that anybody can watch that video and not come out, come back with a verdict of guilty on all three charges. So, uh, we're going to be prayerful and hopeful, and uh, we're going to prepare, uh, expect the best, but prepare for the worst. Uh, so we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Uh, now, I know that you were there with uh, Reverend Sharpton and Dr. Jackson and some of them and Attorney Crump. How are they? Are they hopeful for a guilty verdict on all charges, or uh, you think it's going to be a split split charge? I, I don't know. Um, you know, Reverend Reverend Jesse Jackson has, has been on the front line for a half a century uh, more, and uh, we love him. We respect him. He has done more and given more to the human race than anybody that I know. So Reverend Jackson is here, he's on the ground, he's engaged in the community along with Reverend Sharp, and of course, uh, Ben Crump is the Perry Mason of the, of the uh, civil rights movement as it is today. So uh, it's a good team of us here, advocates, uh, community leaders and servants, and uh, Reverend Jackson always gives great positive leadership uh, to the community and of 